kind of just like this ritual of getting ready to go out there and pretty much go into battle with your teammates. I get dressed the same way every single game. I tape my stick before every single game, the same color tape, same wax. Um, and the moment for me that it feels most like, okay, like here we go, time to do this is when I'm tying my skates. And then um, another awesome moment where you just are kind of like amped up and ready to go is that second where like everybody's just going onto the ice uh, to start out warm ups. I came here my freshman year and we didn't have a hockey team yet. So I played broom ball for two years and I loved that, but I was still missing the feeling of skating. Um, and every time we'd go to a rink and there'd be a hockey game on, I would not be able to take my eyes off of it. And I would just be thinking about like that feeling of skating and being on a women's team and having teammates and celebrating after a goal. I kind of immediately kind of set out trying to find other girls that wanted to play hockey and I found my current roommate uh, and teammate Jesse actually and we kind of just got started on setting the team up. It was very challenging to get this club together and I know there were a lot of times that Jesse and I thought maybe this wasn't something that the Midwest was ready for, maybe there weren't going to be enough uh, women that were interested in this. But for me, it changed everything to have a team here to belong to, and I know a lot of the girls feel the same way about that. During practice, we work on things like breakouts, um, coming back in to regroup and try to get some offense generated. Um, that's definitely something we've been a little weak on this year, but we're hoping to build up next year, especially as we get more players coming in. I talked to a number of girls coming from places like Minnesota who are considering the university because there's a women's hockey team here. So in practice, we're really just trying to get uh, those fundamental skills and fundamental drills down so that we can build on that um, both during the season and in the season coming up. As I said, we've had a few really tough losses this year, but the most amazing thing to see is in the locker room, the captains, girls on the team, everybody just talks about the game, talks about what we can improve on. And there was actually a moment in one of our last games, which was one of our hardest, and we came off of a really tough period, and our captain, Allison, came in and just asked everybody why it is they decided to play hockey in the first place, to just remind everyone that that's why we're doing this, and to keep that in mind as we went back out for the second period. And it refocused everybody, and we had a much better end of the game so I would say those moments are the most fun on the team as well as I mean we are all students here so we have classes together we study together and we've been traveling together a lot this year so that's been a lot of fun as well everybody keeps in mind like what a privilege it is to be able to play for this team to be able to represent Nebraska and we've really come together with that I would like you and all students to know that if you're considering doing something like this Keep trying until you're able to make it a reality and if you're interested in playing women's hockey this is an amazing place to do it and it is a growing club which is awesome to see.